Hey everyone, Captain CA here, and welcome back to Flats Class YouTube. Today, I'm going to teach you a knot that you need to know. So let's go inside and break it down quickly. I'm going to teach you a knot, and this is a knot my dad taught me when I was a kid, and it's still a relevant knot in fishing today, and it is the double uni knot. It's a knot that you need to know to connect your braided line to a piece of either fluorocarbon or mono leader. Now, if you're new to inshore fishing, this knot is a simple knot for you to learn. In Flats Class University, I teach the Alberto knot, I teach the FG knot, I teach the modified Albright knot as the best connecting knots line to leader. But with these lightweight braids and so many of you guys getting involved, taking your bass gear, trying to figure this stuff out, you move from the Midwest or the Mississippi River Valley or somewhere in the Northeast, and you're just figuring this game out, leader materials are generally, in, in short, they're somewhere between 20 pound and 40 pound 80% 80, 80 of the time. 80% of the time, that's what they are. But these thin braids, these soft, supple, long casting braids that Diamond makes, you, you have to be able to tie a balanced knot. The knot can't be weighted too heavy on one side or the other. Uh, and typically, because the thickness of the leader is greater, it requires you to double this line. So I'm going to adjust my camera and I'm going to tie this knot for you. And uh, once you see it, you'll go, damn, that is so easy. I should, I should learn this knot. And there are a lot of professional guides, I'm going to tell you right now, that, uh, that have never learned another knot. This is the only knot they know is the double uni. So even though I call it a beginner's knot, which it is, uh, there's a lot of journeyman anglers that are still using the uni knot. It's just the uni knot system works, whether it's a uni or a double uni. This is two uni knots that slide together in the middle and create one knot. So here we go. Let me adjust the camera and we'll get started. I'm going to try to do this real time. I know it's kind of tough to see everything. This is 10 pound. Uh, in many cases, you'll have to use six and eight pound in inshore fishing, believe it or not. But 10 pounds, pretty, pretty utilitarian. Most of us use it. I like to double it. See how I've doubled that braid? And it makes it a single line that's just thicker, easier to deal with. Then I take my leader material, okay? And we overlap these two, okay? By a couple of inches, just like so. You're gonna take your tag leader you're going to create a loop just like so. Then you're going to come through here with a tag and go around your double braided line four times. Four times. One, two, three, four. That's it. Then you're going to pull it together into a little. It almost looks like a little barrel there. Then all you're going to do is turn this around and you're going to mimic what you just did. Now you're going to go around your leader with your double tag line from your main line here. So let me grab a hold of it. Okay. And I'm going to create a loop here, just like I did the last time, just like that. And I'm going to go through four times. One, two, three, four. So it looks like that. And then gently pull that together so it makes a little barrel there, just like so. So now this should look like this. Two of them separated a little bit, but you're gonna pull them together. So I'm gonna grab the tag of the blue main line right here. I'm gonna grab this tag here and I'm gonna pull on the leader. all 
the same time. I want them to come together slow. Just like that. See, I'll pull tight. So they back up to each other. And then I'm gonna pull a little bit tighter. And you're gonna end up, it looks like you've got quite the interstate spaghetti there. <laughs> but now you just get your nippers out and I highly recommend buying a pair of these boomerang nippers. Um, this one's branded for Sodium USA, but um, just go online and order you some. May as well go to SodiumUSA.com and order them because it's going to be a better buy there. And I'm going to cut all my tags off. And you're going to love this little knot. And you can see I slowed it down so you guys could watch the knot get tied. But for the most part, Get that little piece of tag off there. For the most part, that's your knot right there. You see that knot? That is your knot. And that is a nice, strong, 100% knot that you can pull through your guides. Now, like I said earlier, you definitely want to learn the three knots that I mentioned before, but if you're just getting into this and you want to know a good, strong, easy knot to tie, it is the double uni knot, just like that. That's all you need to know. And you're fishing. You, you are going fishing now. It's that simple. Hey, if you like what you see here at Flats Class YouTube, you're learning stuff, give us the thumbs up. It helps us trend. And hit that subscribe and notification bell. By doing just that, we will move up in the suggestions and this channel grows. And the sooner I get to 50,000 subscribers, the faster I can hire a full-time cameraman to come with us and do all kinds of things in different, different areas. If you like this kind of stuff or you were intrigued by what I said about flatscustuniversity.com, go over there and check out that, that site. See what we have to offer there. If you're an intermediate to advanced angler, I think you're going to want to join up. All right. That's all I got for you today. Until next time, you guys keep those rods bent and I'll keep the videos coming.